What's up, y'all? I'm Karen. And it's your girl, Dee Dee. And this is the Karen and Dee Dee Show. What's up, people? people? So, last night, there were two things going down. Yes. And if you're like us, we're political. We watch it all. Republicans and Democrats. Yes. And um, Barack Obama, President Barack Obama was speaking. Mm -hmm. And we had two TVs in the room. We had one on the VMAs and the other one on the president. Mm -hmm. I love the president. He I, I do too. The president, but we had to see what was going on to clock some tea. I mean, how, how else right. are you going to clock tea? But anyway, you weren't trying to throw shade. Though. No, girl, oh, I was not right. trying to throw yeah. shade at you. You're because political. You, I like, you like all yes, the politics. I like everything. Yes. And I'm mean, like, all in the politics. I surely am. And and by the way, the president gave a a great speech. I love the speech, and I also love Bill Clinton's speech. The night before. Yes. Bill Clinton kicked oh, some butt. Yes, I, he did. You know what? I have Loved never it. saw a speech that got that deep into everything. I mean, like, I mean, it's like he it took his jacket out. off and his shoes on, sat on the couch and started just talking. Yes. And that's... I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. But, Ooh. Oh. let's dip into the VMAs. <sighs> it started off with Rihanna doing her thing. Doing it big, doing Rihanna. She opened the show. I loved her performance. She was trying to do her little dances and stuff. I thought it was pretty good. You know what? I didn't like the short, short hair, though. I have I, to say. I, I like, like her with short hair, but I didn't like it. I didn't like it. I like Rihanna. I, yeah. But you know what? I'm really looking for new rock and rollers. I'm looking for new hip hoppers. Yes. New R&B, new poppers. I'm just looking for a whole new set of individuals to right. come in in this new decade and kill and get awards for it. I'm tired of the same old, the people. Same old people getting awards. Now, I know Rihanna, she's the queen of it all mm -hmm. right now, and she deserves it because she's been hitting it hard since she stepped into the but game. But guess what? I was a little but, shocked that um, Jay-Z and Beyonce didn't win nothing because, baby, every time they win it, I was a little shocked. Like, oh, my God, I was sure Beyonce was going to take that video award for Love on Top, but she didn't. But anyway, moving right, right along. I, as you notice, I did do this, like, to the left, to the left. Right, well, to the left, to the left, but I'm just saying, you know. But I'm, I'm glad for Beyonce and Jay-Z not getting anything because it's time for new people. New people. To come in and yeah. dominate. I'm looking for people like Usher and all those people to just lay back in the cut. He was nominated. You've had, you've had a lot of awards. You've won a Over lot of years. awards. Very you've successful. You've done a lot of great performances. I don't think there's another performance we can get from either. Well, well Beyonce is always great. You, you just need her yeah, at the show. Yeah, you can't. You, that's the show has to go. If the show isn't thing, a show without Beyonce. Love Beyonce or hate her. The one thing you can say about her is she she's a damn good performer. She when she get up there and perform, I mean, that's you cannot take that away from the girl. The girl can perform. I give her that. Mm -hmm. She got it. Oh, yeah. She got it on that. She I give her she that. She is putting them bitches in boxes. We don't know if that you know, going, if that baby really came out of her. But guess what? She can perform. Hey, it Shit. is what it is. Mm -hmm. Because you know what? Any way the baby got here. She got a right, but I'm just saying, so like, it's girl, all it was a lot. But you know, my violent. thing is, I like the award show. It's just I'm I'm really looking for BET. I mean, because <laughs> they all the MTV, now. BET, all <laughs> they all owned by the same by so. But I'm looking for MTV to start playing videos again, and not in the wee peaks in the morning. I'm talking about real video hour where you're playing some videos, and I'm not talking about that countdown where it's right. these videos have to play. I'm talking like the old days where it's like a radio show. Well, every hour there was videos by everybody. Right. That's what I'm looking for because right now there's no place for people to zone in. But anyway, the show was fabulous. Uh, I like the part where Rihanna gives Chris Brown a hug. I thought that was cute. Well, I mean, you know what? This That came up. That was behind the scenes. That was, wasn't intended, I guess, for our <laughs> viewing. But, um, yeah, she ended up, you know, I guess congratulating him and giving him a little kiss and a hug and... And really, mainly, that's it. I read some blogs and people making such a big deal about it, talking about, you know, the girl's stupid and she shouldn't be back with him and all that. I'm like, you know what? Get over it. If she, if she forgave him, then, I, I mean, he didn't do shit to us. We could forgive him, too. So I feel like that's her choice. You know what I mean? That's that's up to her. If she she forgiven him and moved on, they're in, I feel like they're in the interest, industry together. They're going to, they, they may, you know, they're going to see each other a lot. You know, and they may even continue to work together. But, you know, I just feel like 
just let it go. You know, if, if she's moved on, that's all right. It happened to her. It didn't happen to everybody right. else. Right, and that's that woman's life. She proclaimed her love for the man. Yeah, and, and she that said he was she her still first loved love. Him. Right. She still loved him. So that's just not going to go she forgave him, hey, it's not fucking business. Exactly. And I just feel like... And who told anybody that she was, you know, your role model and she had to stand for Exactly. You. That's what I was trying You, You was reading my mind. Yeah, that's what I was, was about time. to say. You don't, these celebrities should not be your children's or role your model. role models. If you're role models, <laughs> you should not, your kids should not be looking up to Rihanna and Chris Brown to, for uh, advice and how they're going to live their life. Your parents should be your role models. You know what I'm saying? It should go back to the parents. And not celebrities. You don't base your life up on celebrities. So that's some bullshit right there. They need to stop that shit. And that girl said she is not a role model. She's still living her life. She's only in her 20s. So how's she going to be a role model to somebody? She's still screwing up. She's still got to live and go. To, so I respect her for that. And you know what? When, when I was younger, I do. we all used to like Michael Jackson. Everybody would say, oh, I want to be Michael Jackson. Right. Who knew wanting to be Michael Jackson meant uh, Demerol drips, uh, drugs, Bleaching perms and wigs. Some it, shit. Who, who knew like, all that? Like, right. You know who who knew that but it was more that than was just, just the dancing life. and singing. This man had other shit going on. A lot of other shit going on. A lot that we didn't know about. See, now back then when we were looking at these celebrities, we didn't. The internet wasn't as big or not even non-existent back when he was popular. Mm -mm. I mean, no. I mean, we didn't know what was going on with these people, so they were. It, the, the mystique of their celebrity was very intriguing and interesting to us. So, you know, that's what made them more of a celebrity. Now, these people don't even seem like celeb you know, what you would call celebrities because we know too much of their business. We know too much of, you know, what's going on. So it's like, you're, you're really just like an everyday person to, well, to me anyway. Yeah, we know what she's Shit's because, going on yeah, in real time. We exactly. don't know like six so months it's later. Like different. I it's think, in real time. I think that's a problem with I think that's one of the problems why they can't sell the kind of records they used to. Now, getting back to the show. Yes. Because you I went just, all off. Yeah, I, I know. know. I don't know what's you, going on what with happened? you. But anyway, um, my girl, Nicki Minaj, did her thing. With Alicia Keys. With Alicia Keys. I like the whole... I don't like Alicia's Nicki. hair. No, I, didn't, I wasn't even going to talk about Alicia. She wasn't even there as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Nicki Minaj did <laughs> great. I love Nicki <laughs> Because the girl who who's supposed to be uh, Alicia, I don't know who that is. That was her. She I don't know who that is and what happened to Alicia. Bro, Alicia used fast. to make really good songs. Mm -hmm. I don't they ran like out of song. they run out of ideas. I don't they like the song. I, I really don't. If somebody like that new song called Fire or something, please let us know because I don't like I'm, it. And my wife and I, my wife's herself, she's had seven whole babies. I didn't have. I sure did. One baby. And it was I was there with her and support. But I didn't have nothing. It was all enjoyment and, and pain I know, at the same time. I know for a fact that after a woman have a baby, something clicks in her head and tells her, hey, I'm going to wear this. It's usually two sizes smaller than she is at the present time. Why and I'm looking, at, a, a I'm looking at that girl, that? Who, that woman up there uh, performing with <laughs> Nicki Minaj. And I'm like, you need to take that her off. Her clothes fit her, though. Yeah, they was fitting. And why would you even bring that up? I know where you're going with it, but really. See, one thing I like about Beyonce, whether she had that baby or not, her when she size came didn't on with her clothes, she looks nice. Yeah, because her size didn't change. She really didn't, you know, her size didn't change. Don't shake my girl. She but in the way, same size. the show was the show. It wasn't a great Mariah show. Mariah Carey got big. It wasn't a oh, and Amber Rose is pregnant. Yeah. Amber Rose is yep, pregnant. She's pregnant for her boy, Wiz. Khalifa. And somehow the whole intriguing thing about her looks just changed when Ooh, she, she said gonna she get was big because I saw a picture of her and she's wide. Like she gonna get big. That baby mm -hmm. gonna look up. So That's once my again, opinion. Here we are with our videos talking about all kind of shit, and we'll see you next week. <laughs> and we love you. We miss you. And we'll be back. Y'all have but a good. But you didn't finish talking about the, the VMAs. After I talked about Swift, Nicki Minaj, Taylor was Swift ended the was show. Was she even there? With, um, Lil Wayne performed. Um, Pink performed. Um, some other people performed, but um, it was you know pretty good show. You know, it wasn't all that to me, but it was pretty good. If you watched it and you enjoyed it, please leave a comment. Let us know if you enjoyed the show. If if you loved it or if you hated it, just put that in the comment section. You know, for us to know because it was okay. Oh yeah, and we gotta we gotta talk about the Braxtons because. 
I, I really got to get on to that. But that's in another video that, you know, I really got to talk about my Braxton's. I really got to talk about this love and hip hop situation and the basketball wise LA is coming up soon. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm going to stay. That's coming back. Yes, next Jackie week. Jackie Christie too? Jackie Christie next oh, yes. week. I'll be there. We will be too. Well, oh, and, and R&B Divas. Everybody get out of chance. R&B Divas? I didn't watch that. I guess because you don't, don't know what TV I don't one know is. some of them old ladies. I don't know them ladies on now. Only one I know is Faith Evans. I don't all know right. all the other ones. All right, it's time to wrap it up. Y'all have a good one. And, uh, oh, give a shout out to my baby. Her birthday is tomorrow. Yes. So She'll be leave, three years old. Leave a happy birthday comment for Mickey. Her name is Mariah Carey. Mariah. But y'all have a good three one. Years old. She'll be three and all of 10 years old. She's very precocious. Y'all have a good one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>